Well, with a possible system brewing in the tropics, Seminole County leaders are preparing to protect the community during a pandemic. Yeah, they've made arrangements for different types of shelters, including one for people who have coronavirus. News 6 is Amanda Castro explains. Seminole County leaders say now's the time to prepare for the potential storm, including COVID positive patients. They're planning to open a special shelter just for those residents, saying they want to keep them safe without spreading the virus. Seminole County Emergency Manager Alan Harris says the county is already calling coronavirus positive patients, figuring out their evacuation plans if a storm comes our way. The county setting up a special shelter for people with COVID-19 and their families, isolating them from other evacuees. Harris says so far, not many positive patients will need the help. It's well under 10%, more like 3 to 5%. The county is also planning to open more general population shelters if necessary to keep the number of people at each site low. Where we would normally have just opened up one shelter for a category one, four, five. So because we have to decrease so much, we have to have a lot more. Harris says evacuating to a shelter should be a last resort, especially this year because of the pandemic. Uh, we're going to do our best to make sure that people are social distanced, but there's only so much social distancing that you can do when you're put, trying to put hundreds of people uh, inside of a building. Harris says they are taking extra safety precautions at shelters, including requiring everyone to wear a mask, get their temperatures checked and practicing social distancing. He says now's the time to plan and if you can stay with friends or family instead of going to a shelter. Reporting in Seminole County, Amanda Castro getting results. News 6.